and uh, Jamie Dornan is going to be probably uh, a, a real interest, big interest, uh, Mr. Gray and all that type of thing. So uh, the the guest list is rather varied. Uh, if you don't mind me saying, it's a high quality guest list. It's not easy to get an interviewee of that standard for the entire six programmes. And all, every person you mentioned, I seriously want to hear what they have to say to you. Partly because of who they are, and partly because of I know how you're going to, as you say, interrogate them. But first and foremost, those people we all want to hear speak. And we want to hear them speak to Mali, answering the questions that possibly only Mali will answer. There, ask. There are different types of interviewers. And <laughs> there's something about you, even the fact that I'm calling you by your surname when I'm saying this, there's something about Mali that's going to make this interesting. That's the hope. Uh, that's the aspiration. Um, it's been great uh, interviewing these people. Um, Jimmy Dornan, a lot out there in, uh, about Jimmy Dornan and the public domain, but uh, I would know the Dornan family for quite a long time. So I hope that th th there's an advantage in that, that I'll be able to bring more of, of, the, of the life behind Jamie Dornan as a student at Methodist College. In fact, he did his first work experience with me in, in Belfast. Um, whether he was aspiring then to be a journalist or not, I don't know, but he, his father got in touch with me and asked me would I take him up to Stormont uh, to see how it worked, etc. So I, I don't know if he even remembers that, but I'm sure he couldn't foresee where he was going <laughs> starting that day at least.